Welcome to MeisterTask 2.0, which was built on a brand new modern tech stack, making the tool much faster and more stable than ever. Of course, the technology isn't the only thing that's changed in MeisterTask, so let me give you a quick tour of what's new. To make better use of the dashboard, MeisterTask now displays the My Tasks widget next to your notifications. The widget is also customizable. Besides tasks that are due, you can choose to show tasks that are in your focus, as well as items from your personal checklist, a feature you may already know from our mobile apps. My checklist items are not associated with any project and can only be seen by yourself. They're perfect for jotting down random to-dos that come up during your day. Sometimes, however, these random to-dos may turn out to be more work than you originally thought. In this case, you can simply convert them into tasks and move them to the appropriate project and section with a few clicks. All right, next let's take a look at the project boards. You'll notice that these have gotten a fresh new look as well, which we hope you'll love as much as we do. The button that toggles your project's activity stream is now located in the top right for easier access. Just like before, you can also switch here to the project filters and either search for a particular keyword or use the various filter options to find tasks you're looking for. While their functionality hasn't changed, our popular Section Actions feature has been renamed to Automations. The new dialog lets you select any section in your project and then pick an automation from a drop-down menu. As always, you can also choose to run the automation on all existing tasks in the specified section. All of your project's automations can also be managed in the Project Properties dialog, and that's not the only thing you can do in here. The first tab on the left now lets you manage exactly who has access to the project and what each project member's role is. You'll notice that a few things that used to be located here in the first tab were moved to the top, such as the project's description and the watch button, which lets you keep track of all goings on in the project with ease. The add-ons tab is where you'll find additional features, add-ons, and integrations you can add to your project. As always, tags is where you manage your project's tags, and checklists is where you create your predefined checklists, both of which you can then quickly add to individual tasks in your project. Our last and perhaps most exciting new feature, on the other hand, affects all tasks in your project, and that's custom fields. Available for all business users, custom fields are predefined elements that, once they're set up, are automatically displayed in all task dialogues. For a project about growth experiments, such as the one we're in right now, we could, for instance, define fields for the experiment's ID, as well as the experiment owner. To help your colleagues fill out these fields correctly, you can add a short description next to them. Now, if we open any task in the project, the fields we've just defined are already there and ready to be filled out with the appropriate information. All right, last but not least, let's take a look at the new My Account area. This is where you can manage everything from your account's password, language setting, and connected accounts to your license, your integrations with other tools, your notification settings, and much more. If you're using MindMeister in addition to MeisterTask, you can also manage all settings relating to the other tool in here. We hope you enjoy using the all-new MeisterTask, and stay tuned for more exciting updates.